In this video we are going to talk about weirdest deep sea creatures. So before starting, please like this video and subscribe to this channel for our future updates. According to Columbia University's Earth Institute, scientists know more about space than they do about the ocean. In some ways, the majority of the organisms lying beneath the surface could pass for aliens. Meanwhile, Dalhousie University researchers in Nova Scotia, Canada, estimate that 91% of these aquatic species are yet unknown to mankind. Many of the 235,000 or so species we know about have adapted to their habitat through unique camouflage, bioluminescence, and mating patterns, resulting in some truly bizarre appearances. The following are some of our favorite weirdest deep-sea species. Number 10. Nudibranch. Because there are over 3,000 different species of nudibranch known, this type of sea slug is incredibly diverse in its habitat. From the north and south poles to the tropics, these little fellas can be found almost anywhere in the world, in both shallow and deep water, in both warm and cold water. Nephronudibranchs can be divided into two types, droid nudibranchs, which are smooth, and have feather-like gills on their backs to aid in their breathing, and elid nudibranchs, which breathe through an organ called a serrata, which is also located on their backs, but is different from the droid nudibranchs. Because the tiny nudibranch lacks a protective shell, it instead camouflages itself with brilliant colors to serve as a warning signal to predators. Their most bizarre adaption, though, is their capacity to physically absorb and digest stinging cells from prey, allowing them to utilize them again and again. Number 9. Giant Isopod. In 2010, an isopod reaching 2.5 feet in length was discovered by a remotely operated underwater vehicle. Isopods are organisms that are native to cold, deep seas and can grow to be quite massive in size. Despite their enormous size, these crustaceans, which resemble giant woodworms, are predators who prey mostly on dead species that have fallen to the ocean's floor. Despite the fact that they were found back in 1879, these organisms are still mostly a mystery to scientists today. According to popular belief, Huge isopods grow to such enormous sizes in order to withstand the pressure exerted on them at the ocean's bottom. Number 8. The Squid Worm. It was during a cruise in a remotely operated vehicle that traveled 1.8 miles beneath the surface of the water that researchers with the census of marine zooplankton made the original discovery of the squid worm in 2007. It is known as the tentacles fish because it has 10 appendages extending from its head that resemble tentacles, which gives it its distinctive appearance. In the marine environment, marine snow is a word used to describe debris that falls from the open waters above and is collected by the squid worm. Number 7. Box Crab. The box crab, like so many other aquatic species, is extraordinarily adept at masking its presence in its environment. Because the crustacean prefers to remain on the ocean's bottom, it buries itself beneath the sand, with only its eyes visible above the surface of the water's murky depths. As far since the box crab's life cycle is concerned, its mating rituals are one of the most fascinating things to witness, as they nearly redefine what it means to be swept off your feet. Upon discovering his mate, a male box crab grabs her by the claws and pulls her around the seafloor until she molts her shell, at which point the male box crab releases her. Number 6. Christmas Tree Worm. The Christmas Tree Worm was discovered by scientists on Lizard Island, part of the Great Barrier Reef, and was appropriately named after the holiday season. As it turns out, the spiral branches are the worm's breathing and feeding devices, with the worm itself living in a tube between them. The radiales, which are hair-like appendages, cover the tops of these tree-like crowns. When the Christmas tree worm feels threatened, it can remove its mouthparts, which are utilized for breathing and collecting prey. Number 5. Frilled Shark. The frilled shark is one of the most ominous-looking creatures on the face of the earth when it is swimming in the sea. Even though the species appears to be a prehistoric beast, its origins can be traced back more than 80 million years, making it a true relic of the prehistoric era. The frilled shark is a huge shark with a maximum length of roughly 7 feet. It is found in tropical waters. The ruffled appearance of its gills led to the designation of this species. Despite the fact that they are referred to as sharks, 
These animals swim in a sinuous pattern that is similar to that of an eel, despite their name. The majority of their food is comprised of squid, which they consume whole in most cases. Number 4. Ribbon Eel. Indonesian seas, from East Africa to Southern Japan, Australia, and French Polynesia, are home to several kinds of eels, including the ribbon eel and the leaf-nosed moray eel. Most of the time, it can be found tucked away in the tunnels encircling coral reefs. The juveniles are born black with a pale yellow stripe running down the center of their fins, and as they develop in size, their color changes to a vivid blue and yellow combination. It is believed that these eels are protrandic hermaphrodites, which implies that they have the potential to alter their gender from male to female multiple times throughout their lives. Number 3. Frogfish. Frogfish are exceedingly difficult to identify since these sorts of anglerfish appear to be nearly identical to their natural environment, which is mostly composed of coral reefs in the wild. Aesthetically, they have the appearance of sponges or algae-covered rocks, and they are available in almost every color and texture imaginable. Some frogfish even use their camouflage to resemble toxic sea slugs rather than concealing themselves, as opposed to most other fish. The odd mode of propulsion that all species of frogfish employ is something that they all share, regardless of how they seem. Except for the ability to walk on their pectoral fins, which have evolved into arm-like appendages, including one that resembles an elbow, the vast majority of them are capable of swimming as well as walking. Number 2. Pink See-Through Fantasia You should keep in mind that the pink, see-through fantasia is actually a sea cucumber that can only be found around 1.5 miles deep in the Celebes Sea, some 800 kilometers east of Borneo. It is referred to as the pink see-through fantasia because to the color of its skin, which reflects light and gives the illusion of transparency. The intriguing sea cucumber was just discovered a little over a decade ago, in 2007, but it has a survival strategy that says it has been alive for a very long time, it emits bioluminescence to warn off predators, which means it has been around for quite some time. In recognition of the transparency of its skin, the pink see-through fantasia has been given the epithet pink see-through fantasia. Because of this, you can view the creature's mouth, anus, and intestines all at the same time. Number 1. Peacock Mantis Shrimp There are two types of peacock mantis shrimp, those that live in the Indian and tropical western Pacific Oceans, and those that live in the tropical eastern Pacific Ocean. It is known for its ability to punch victims with its front two appendages in a short period of time. According to Oceana, an international ocean preservation advocacy group, a punch from this shrimp represents one of the fastest motions in the animal realm. The punch is so powerful that it can break the glass wall of an aquarium, which would ordinarily be impossible to do without the use of special equipment. The fact that they mostly use their steel fists to bash open mollusks and cut crabs into pieces shouldn't cause you any anxiety at this point. What do you think about our video? Please let us know in the comments area below. If you enjoyed this video and would want to hear from me again, please subscribe and turn on the notification before leaving. Thank you for watching us.